Caroline, they say, you know, goals win games and four minutes into the second half of extra time, no better time to get the second goal of the game and decide it. You took, this, you took the score well and now you're looking forward to Crow Park. Yeah, I suppose <clears throat> they marked us very well in the full forward line and they were on top of us for the whole match, but we got a chance there in extra time and we had to take it, but it was hard work today. What was going through your mind when you saw the ball just coming to you and just trying to take that turn to get past the carry defender and then aim the, the shot to put it into the back of the net? To be honest, I just had to get it in my hand first and then just let her into the back of the goal and hope for the best, to be honest. I think, it, yeah, just don't overthink it and just try and nail it into the back of the net. You know, we're a good while now since the full-time whistle has sounded, but I'd say bodies are still absolutely sore inside in that dressing room. Yeah, I think uh, when we went in after, uh, after full-time there, everyone was like so quiet, but we were all just knackered and it was some battle, some match. The mental side, never mind the physical fatigue, but the mental fatigue of that contest, you know, you go in, you, know, you have your normal half-time chat, then you have the full-time chat, which you don't really normally happen, it goes to extra time, and then you have the, that debrief, what was the debrief like, we'll say, in that half-time period and extra time, just before, obviously, you came and you got that goal? What was the thoughts of the squad that time? I suppose we were a few, most of us were in this position last year, extra time, lost by a point to Derry. So I think we just all stood up and said, we can't leave behind us this year and just had to go out and can't do what we done last year. we done that, thank God. Do you think that, I know I was talking to, to Shauna um, earlier in the week, reviewing the semi-finals, but do you think that... You, when you learn from those, we'll say those painful mistakes, those defeats, even that extra time to lose in that fashion, do you think that might have just carried, you know, there was a lot of sore bodies as well, players didn't want to come off, that took, just inspired you in those final minutes, say, look, not again, as you say, not again, we're not losing an extra time. Yeah, <laughs> last year was in the back of our minds all year, going through the league, championship, the whole thing. We're a panel this year, girls put their hand up in extra time, um, they're... They gave everything and the subs came on and won it for us and that's what we've been doing all year. It's, we're a panel effort and it just shows today. So we're probably still on, a, on cloud nine after that. What's, how does it feel now to be looking forward to Crow Park? Yeah, recovery. I've never played there before so it's just excitement and take it all in and yeah, bring us to Croker. <laughs>